Hello guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today we're going to be reviewing this week's Carabao Cup game. Stay tuned. Hey, two, three hundred beats going crazy. Yeah. Okay, guys, let's get right into it. So kicking off today, Tuesday, there's only going to be one match, and that is between Tottenham Hotspur and Chelsea. So as you all know the history of. Uh, Mourinho with Chelsea and now is the head coach at Tottenham so this is going to be a really tense match but I'm really looking forward to see what's going to happen because I know this game is going to be really tight really really tight so I'm predicting the score to be 1-1 then Chelsea will edge Tottenham on penalties 5-4 okay guys so moving on on Wednesday the first match is going to be between Newport County and Newcastle United. Now, this game, I think, is going to be really straightforward. I think it's going to be a stroll for Newcastle. So, I'm predicting the score to be 3-0. 3-0 in favor of Newcastle United. And I think it's going to be a straightforward game. Okay, now to the next game. Burnley versus Manchester City. This game, I feel, is going to be another straightforward game. Though Burnley are a very tough side to play. But I feel Manchester City are going to be really comfortable playing this game. So, I'm predicting the score of 2-0 to Manchester City. So, you guys watch out for this one. Okay, so to the next game. Brighton versus Manchester United. Now, this game was played during the weekend. And Manchester United barely won the game. They were just lucky to get the penalty after the final whistle was blown. So, this game, I think, is going to be really tight once again. But I still feel that Manchester United are going to win it again. So, I'm predicting the score of 2-1 to Manchester United. I feel they're going to win this, this one again. Okay, so moving on to the Goodison Park, Everton versus West Ham United. Now, this game I think is going to be really tight because Everton are having the time of their life in the Premier League, picking up nine points from a possible nine points. And West Ham also picking up a bit of form, beating Wolves 4 0 at the weekend. So, this game I think is going to be tight, but I'm predicting the score of 2 1 to Everton. I think Everton are just going to edge out West Ham. Okay, so moving on to Thursday, and the first match on Thursday is going to be between. Brentford and Fulham. Now, this is a repeat of the playoff finals for 2020. And I think Brentford are really going to be out to get their revenge against Fulham because Fulham edged them 2 0 at the playoff finals. So I really think that Brentford are really going to be out to get Fulham back for that loss. So I'm predicting a score of 2 0 to Brentford. Also, I think Fulham have been really poor in the Premier League. So I think Brentford are going to win this one. Okay, so moving on to the Villa Park. Aston Villa, who have recently hit a bit of form in the Premier League, are going to be taking on Stoke City. Uh, this game, I think, is going to be really straightforward also. I think Villa are just going to win it. So I, I'm predicting the score of 2-0 to Villa. I think Villa are going to beat Stoke City 2-0. So moving to the game of the day, Liverpool versus Arsenal at Anfield. Now, this game also took place during the weekend, in which Liverpool edged Arsenal 3-1. But I don't know, I just have the feeling that Arsenal are actually going to win this one. They're going to be out to have their revenge. And Atesa is going to win the tactical battle against Klopp. So I'm predicting the score of 2-1 in favor of Arsenal. So we've come to the end of the video. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Click the notification bell. And comment on this video. Comment what you think about this video. Thank you guys for your support. Hey, 2-300 beats going crazy.